Good morning, this is Brandon. It is December 2nd, 2020. Um, and stick around to the end of the video. I have a surprise announcement. I think you guys are really going to like it. So uh, without further ado, uh, this is the trade that I want to show you today. Um, this is from the pre-market plan of attack from this morning. You can see, and I'm going to see if this works. Um, so hopefully you can make that out. The level that he gave us this morning was 49.56 on Intel, and he he said uh, in the pre-market plan of attack that he's only interested in taking a short on Intel because it had a huge day yesterday, and uh, there was some other there there were some other subtleties that uh, led him to suggest that uh, that we should be looking for a short on Intel. So here's my trading chart from this morning. Um, <laughs> Thinkorswim is back to to showing the trade executions on the chart. Again, no idea why that wouldn't work yesterday, but here's that level, the 49.56. This is my standard risk box. These uh, put contracts, uh, the 49.50 puts for Friday, they're pretty inexpensive, about um, 50, anywhere from 38 to 50 cents a piece. So I was trading um, somewhat larger size and uh, basically just started in. When it came up into the level here, um, I added on. Uh, this is kind of hard to make out. Let's see what we can do here. So I bought, I was basically buying them in threes. I bought three at, uh, here I know what we can do. That's better. So I bought three contracts at 54 cents, bought more as price started to invade that standard risk box. Um, <clears throat> and uh, bought four more as we were, I think, about halfway into the standard risk box. Bought four more as we, I think, were about two-thirds or so into the box. Um, and then we were approaching approaching the top of the standard risk box, um, and I grabbed eight contracts there. Um, so 3, 11, uh, plus 8 is 19. <laughs> 27 contracts in all, um, and then as uh, Intel dropped down, paid myself on a good number of those contracts, uh, 15, 18, um, and then Intel started rising again um, and invaded that standard risk box again. So I started adding back in really small here, just one contract, one contract, and then um, I hit it with four and got pretty close oops hold on a sec sorry about that got pretty close to the low uh the low tick right there um low of that candle was 36 cents and i grabbed four contracts for 38 cents uh and then paid myself as it as intel dropped back down and the puts got more expensive <clears throat> at this point here let's see here let's back out a little bit whoa uh, so at this point here, Intel uh, made a lower low and was looking really good. Um, and so I think I was down to just six, six contracts at that point. Um, and then, and so I started just taking them off just one at a time. Unfortunately, uh, the high here was 60 cents and I, I took only one off for, for 59 cents. Um, you know, so that was a great exit obviously but uh, I only took one contract off I was I was planning to you know I was, it was looking like Intel would just drop the rest of the day and I, I wanted to still have some some bullets in the chamber here um, as the puts got more and more expensive but it didn't end up working out so I sized down uh, and I had only two contracts after I took that off and and then I got rid of the last two right there so Really, uh, really great trade. Could have been bigger, um, but 
but I'm more than happy with it. Here, here's that lower low. So this was a slightly higher high. I think that's where I grabbed those uh, those final uh, four contracts at eight at 38 cents, um, and this was a nice nice decline. So paying myself as that dropped, a um, little bit of a, a speed bump here, but then it made that lower low, and that's why I was like. I, I did pay myself with that one contract at 59 cents right there at 912. You can see that there, 912. Um, yeah, and this was looking great, right? Um, but uh, you know, it turned around. So, so I had to bail on the rest. My average price um, were the, was that 48 cents on those last two, last um, two contracts there. So I just. I just took them off at, at break even there, and um, and that was the trade. I also wanted to show you this Apple chart real quick. Um, the original level during the pre-market plan of attack was a bit higher. Um, and then just a few minutes before the uh, before the opening bell, or maybe it was a few minutes after the opening bell. I don't really remember which one, but the point is, um, Pat actually real time called out a lower level. He said, "I'm I'm moving the level down to 121." And so I just wanted to show uh, how how incredibly well this level worked out. I didn't I didn't take this trade. Um, I was in the Intel trade and, you know, things were going fine there. So it didn't feel like I wanted to add another position. Um, but just, just, uh, it's just a great example of how well these levels, uh, work, um, came, came really fast down, down into that level. Um, so that would be the time to start accumulating some contracts. You actually can pay yourself and 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 rake in a little bit of profit just on that bounce right there. Let's take a look at what what would have been possible. 8:45 and 8:46. So let's look at that on the on the options chart here. This is the 121 level. So you'd be you'd be trading Friday's 121 calls. And what did I say? 8:30, 8:45. So there's 8:45. So low there is, uh, uh, gosh dang it, sorry, dismiss. Uh, the low of that uh, put contract was $1.40, $1.38. Um, and then just that one minute bounce takes it all the way up to uh, 158. So let me bust out my calculator. Let's say 158 divided by 140. So that's 12%, a bit more than 12% up for grabs, uh, just on that one candle. Um, so then it, it actually came back down to the level, and this is a this is a fantastic setup right here uh, when it made a slightly higher low there, and then uh, just bounced hard. Um, so obviously, could could have uh, made a pretty dang good profit on those uh, 121 calls. So yeah, just wanted to show that trade as well. <clears throat> okay, so now for the big announcement, um, I I have revived my uh, beliefTrader.com website, and I am running a promotion here for the month of December. I'm having a little bit of a sweepstakes here. Uh, and if you know if you're if you've watched my reviews, you know uh, you know how highly I think of the uh, Trick Trade service. Um, I think it's the best uh, best day trading service anywhere. Um, great for small accounts. Uh, you know, profitable, very easy to be consistently proud, profitable, very easy to follow strategy. Uh, excellent levels, good guidance. You know, real time um, screen share. You name it. It's just it, this is just the place to be if you want to 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 you know become a day trader and learn how to trade the markets and generate a consistent income, pay your bills. Uh, this is definitely the place to be. And um, if you're on the fence and you're you don't want to pay that first uh, 
that that monthly first month membership fee to join trick trades I I'm now taking that excuse off the table um, so I'm going to run a little bit of a raffle sweepstakes sort of um, program here um, so all you have to do is come to my website <clears throat> put in your name and email address and you'll get one entry into this raffle and I'm gonna draw the winner uh, on New Year's Eve um, and then the cool thing about the, uh, the way I did this site um, is once you once you put in once you sign up put in your name and email address you're gonna get a special uh, link a special unique URL just for you and then what you can do is go ahead and share that link anywhere email text any social media in a chat room wherever you want to share that link and if somebody clicks on your link and comes over to this site and signs up with their name and email address you're gonna get five extra entries into the raffle you'll also get an extra entry um, whenever if you share it if you share your link on Facebook or Twitter or there's a, a few different social media platforms uh, where you can get an extra entry as well but the, the, the best odds of winning is if you can get your friends to click on your link and sign up um, and and then the same deal will be available to them they can they'll, they'll get their own link and they can sign up or they can post and share their link and get um, extra entries into the raffle as well so we'll be drawing the winner on New Year's Eve and the winner uh, will go ahead and sign up for a guidance membership on trick trades and I will uh, reimburse that that first month's fee um, it should be it's like 197 uh, per month and then um, you can use the uh, TT20 <clears throat> coupon code to get 20% off um, so it should be about 157 or so and I'm gonna reimburse that for you so you can come in you can try out the uh, the trick trades room you can watch all the videos you can get all the levels every morning um, you know the whole deal and it won't cost you anything because I'll be uh, paying that first month for you so go ahead and head over to the website and sign up and share that link that you get um, and try to get as many entries as you can and we'll have a we'll, we'll see who wins alright thanks for watching guys bye